Redneck Tony says, okay, but the real question is, why don't they just ride their horse to town like a cowboy instead of pulling the buggy much faster? So I get asked this a lot, and there's a couple different reasons for that. The first reason being is when you're riding a horse, all your weight is sitting on top of that horse. It tires the horse out much faster, okay? And besides that, you can only usually carry one person on a horse. If you pull a buggy, you can have six, eight people in there, and it's still not as hard on that horse as one person on his back. Because the buggy wheels are so big, it reduces the amount of force necessary to pull the buggy. And since most Amish families have, you know, my family was a relatively smaller one. There was eight kids. There was ten people. Can you imagine having ten horses? Taking ten horses to church every morning? You know, those ten horses are going to take up space at this barn, you know, at where the church is. Or we could just hop in a buggy and take two or three buggies and have three horses over there. So if everybody rode to church, every Amish person rode to church on their own buggy, there would not be enough space to keep all those horses. And there would, you couldn't be able to afford all the horses you'd need for every member of your family. So in conclusion, the reason that you don't see a lot of Amish people riding their horses versus having them pull their buggies is because it's not practical. It's not practical when you think about all the amount of children they have, let alone, you know, there's always a, a baby in a, a normal Amish family, so how would you carry that on the back of a horse? I used to have a horse that I could ride, but my dad would not buy me a saddle. So, But he did allow me to go work at the neighbor's harness shop to pay off for the saddle myself, so that's what I did. And riding a horse was fun, but like I said, it's just not practical.